Hi, I am uh, Dr. Akash Srivastava uh, from the National Center for Disease Control, Additional Director, NCDC Delhi, and I also uh, am the technical lead here for the National Program on Climate Change and Human Health. And uh, I wish to welcome you to this workshop today that's being organized by Selco Foundation for the Northeastern States uh, and giving you an opportunity to understand uh, the solarization requirement for the Northeastern States from the NHM, from the NPCCHS program and all officials who are present today from, from the states of the Northeastern part of the country. Uh, I am very pleased to know that you all have gathered on this meeting, which is being organized uh, with support of Selco Foundation. And uh, you all know that uh, in the broader realm of climate change and health, <clears throat> we have been uh, under the NPCCHS program, also being uh, talking about the importance of making our healthcare facilities resilient to the impact of climate change. Providing energy through solar panels, solarization of all the energy sources in the healthcare facilities has two special benefits. The first, that it makes the health facility resilient in the sense that if there is a disconnect from the main grid, whenever you are impacted by an extreme weather event, you would have your own supply of energy to maintain essential services. And that would be of paramount importance, especially in the northeastern part of the country, where you are usually impacted heavily whenever there is a such extreme weather events. And <clears throat> being remoted, uh, being located remotely, uh, Transporting the patients and their healthcare services getting disrupted becomes very difficult uh, for the patient care. And that is when being self reliant on your energy services becomes of importance. The second way in which it helps is also uh, making these health facilities. Uh, a step towards low carbon emission. And that is uh, another relevant fact in context of climate change as being low carbon emitting facilities, your contribution towards the climate change burden reduces. And in this way, by bringing in solarization to these health facilities, we are benefited in these two main ways and in this effort, we have in India uh, taken the support of agencies to provide technical and <clears throat> essential guidance in how to undertake solarization. And in northeastern part of the country, Selco has taken a lead in this. And bringing you all together here from the NHM and from the NPCCHH program officials, I think you have this opportunity to understand the details of this uh, factor of how to undertake solarization and have an opportunity of interaction with the CELCO officials and have also an opportunity to uh, see with your own eyes uh, certain models that have been developed 
in the given city where this uh, workshop is happening. I will recommend all the states to come forward, take up this challenge, and make your own healthcare facilities resilient. This will come a long way in making us climate resilient, healthcare infrastructure, and health resilience in, in, in total. So, dear colleagues, with this, I hope that this workshop is going to be of much use and provide you necessary knowledge to take this step forward. I wish you a very uh, useful, productive workshop and good learning from it. With that, best wishes. Namaste.